What's up, OCC gang? This is Vlogmas Day 2, and I'm in Bath and Body Works. If you saw my video yesterday, this was the vibe. I was trying to come up in Bath and Body Works, but hi. Yes, please. Thank you so much. Do you need one or two? Um, just one, thank you. Two, two, get another one, get another one. She said one or two, I got candle fever. I was like, wait, we're gonna need two. Thank you, Deja. So if you were watching my video yesterday, y'all know, I was like, I was not coming up in here, but when we came back past the door, there was no line. The security guard was inside, looked like she's shopping too. Listen, it's on. They have a lot of new scents. I know I'm supposed to be in here looking at candles, but some of this stuff just looks so yummy. Like, it looks like it smells so good. Have y'all tried some of these new ones? Wild sand, chasing fireflies. I like these socks too. Oh, these socks are so soft, y'all. Oh my gosh, they are so soft. Baking spirits, right? Treat yourself to cozy. They feel so soft. What else do they have? There are so many nice scents. Champagne toast, now that's a classic. We already know about that one. Let's keep looking. Let's see what else they have. Strawberry snowflakes. That sounds like it smells good. Winterberry wonder. That sounds like it smells good too. You know they have Among the Clouds. I wanted to get Among the Clouds last time, but I didn't. I think I didn't get it because my sister ended up getting it. I think that was why I didn't get it. Because like, I don't want to smell the same as the person I hang out with a lot. Like, we're hanging out together. I don't want to smell the same way she's smelling, but she ran out, so it might be my turn to get some, too. I don't know. I don't know. That always happens. Like, if there's a scent that I really like and I'm into it, like, before I can even tell anybody, here she comes, like, just wearing the scent that I want. It's like, she has this Cartier perfume that I wanted so bad. It's by Cartier. And I wanted that perfume so bad. And then she gets in the car and I'm like, what's that smell, Tiffany? And she's like, it's my new Cartier perfume. It smells so good, doesn't it? I was so mad. That always happens. So whatever scent I get today, hopefully she's not picking up the same thing. I think it's because we're sisters. We end up wearing the same scents. It's so aggravating, but so funny at the same time. I still love it. I kind of know some of the candles that I want to get already. Oh my gosh, y'all, I just had a surreal moment. I'm in Bath and Body Works for Candle Day. <gasps> Even though I said I wasn't coming, I'm here. <gasps> it just kind of all worked out. Mm -mm -mm. It just worked out. I kind of know some of the scents that I want to get already, um, but I'm having like second thoughts. Like, see, this is what I don't like. Somebody has this candle sitting right on the edge. And somebody like me will walk by and knock it off and look like the candle breaker. See, somebody's, somebody's setting somebody up. That's why I pushed it back because, oh, that smells so good. I wouldn't want that to happen to anybody else. Anyways, um, the scents that I wanted, I want the French bread scent because that scent is crazy hard to find and I don't know if they still even have it, but that is one of the best smells that they have. I want that. I want um, the butter pecan scent. Um, the cinnamon, I think it's like cinnamon waffles something or another. I can't really remember I just know that I had it and I bought two of them and I burned them completely out because they were so good um, Let's just look around because I'm getting so excited just talking about them. I've never smelled this one before Like I'm wondering if it even feels right to like get non-holiday scents at candle day I always get I don't, this one doesn't really smell that Like maybe you have to burn it. I'm not really getting that much from it mm. That smells so, so good. That smells like spring and like sitting by the pool, going to the beach. I love that so much because what happened to me last time was when spring rolled around, all my candles smelled like Christmas and I was mad. So maybe, just maybe this time, I need to get some brighter scents. Ooh, this one, I didn't think I would find this. This was going really fast online. Sugared lemon zest. Let's smell this. Oh oh my gosh oh my gosh it's tangy lemons bright lemon zest fresh sugar cane with natural essential oils and it is giving all of the above it is giving i have to get this do you remember those lemon drops um what do they call those things they come in like a yellow pack y'all know what i'm talking about lemon heads aren't they called lemon heads i used to eat them when i was a kid smells exactly like it oh my gosh this is funny because i got this last time and i loved it but right now i'm just not it's not bad, it's just not the mood I'm in, I guess. It does smell like marshmallows, like it smells like you're doing s'mores outside. It really does smell good, but I'm just not like in the same mood right now. But it smells really good. 
I'm still thinking about getting it because my mood might change like in a week, in a month. And by January, I might really want that like when it really gets cold because it's not really that cold right now in Florida. So sometimes I feel kind of silly getting those scents that feel like all the warm feelings because we warm for real. Like it's hot outside. Still in Florida, it's not cold right now. It is still hot. And we out here wearing jackets and sweaters just to get in the Christmas spirit. But we be sweating under these jackets and sweaters because it is not cold. So far, I have like three, maybe four candles. Deja has like, how many do you have? One. She has <laughs> one candle. <laughs> Oh, but the good news is the candle she's holding are mine too. So what are you smelling? This watermelon lemonade right here. Watermelon lemonade? Oh, Deja, don't drop the candle. Why are you holding a candle like with one hand like that? They can't smell the candle. Y'all can't smell they the can candle. This is why she's not in this is why I'm not putting her in the videos because she is going all Gen Z on me and acting crazy. They are not smelling. You see how these Gen Z young people say stuff like, use your imagination, smell the candle through the camera. Like she really feels that you can like manifest that. No, no. I had to set the phone down so I could smell some more candles because Deja is not about to hold the phone for me because Deja is out here doing the most. Ooh, what is this? Lavender marshmallow. This is something. You, you know, you can't really get the full essence of candles like just by smelling them in the store. Y'all know that, right? Like you have to like burn them to really know. But you can get that first whiff. So I'm gonna smell watermelon lemonade. That's really bright. It's really bright. It's okay. Come on, are you into candles? Yes, yes. So, I like them too. That's yes. so cool. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> um, there's another one that uh, smells real nice. Um, the white gardenia smells real nice. But the, the other one uh, it doesn't smell sickening sweet. It's nothing yeah. like that. It, but it smells real nice in the room. Yes, ma'am. Thank you so much. Oh, you just cut my trip in half. Thank you. <laughs> So we got some really good recommendations, y'all. I have some good ones that I'm gonna go and smell. I mean, he gave me some really good ideas. So I'm gonna go around and smell all of those. And then I'll show you what I got. But I'm excited. I love meeting new people on Candle Day. That's one that I came. That's one of the best things, meeting new people talking. Um, with other people who love candles as much as I do because if you know anybody who doesn't really like candles and you love them, everyone else thinks you're crazy. So it's nice to be, it's nice to be like with all the candle crazes today. It's nice and it, and it definitely fills up the room. I'm going to get this one too. Thank it, you. That, that's a good one. Yes, ma'am. Yeah, this, like this, this champagne toast, I'm telling you, that is off the chain. You're going to love that one. I think you're the second person who told me this. So I'm yeah. going to try it. It's that, right that here. Is, yeah, that is off the chain. I'm telling you. Thank you. Oh, that's pretty. It is, and I tell you, when it burns, I'm telling you, it's really nice. What it fills up the room. Goats? It's really nice without being overpowered, oh, without being nice. sickly sweet. Yes. Thank you. Okay. I think I got my last one. Thank you so much. Yes, <laughs> oh, okay. Did you smell this? Okay. Ooh, oh, that smells good. Doesn't it? The notes are bubbly champagne, sparkling berries, juicy tangerine, and essential oil. Found that I've discovered. I tried that when it came out for thank for uh, October. Oh, I had this one before. Did you I have that one? I love it. Is that one good one, dude? Yes, I love it. I think I still have a little bit left. Yes. There's only one I didn't find. That's going to be the one that smells like bread. I can't remember what it's called. I have to ask one of the girls. And it's funny, I can't remember what it's called because last year I got two because one of the ladies here recommended it to me and I was skeptical, but she was like, this one goes fast, it goes first. Go ahead and get it. So I got two because she was like really telling me about it and I burned them out just like that because they smell so good. Excuse me, you know that candle that smells like bread, French something? Okay, so I just asked one of the girls. She did not know what I was talking about. It would help if I knew the name of the candle, but that's okay. She said they have a candle guru and she's about to go get him and she said he will get me right, okay? So hopefully he knows what I'm talking about. This smells so Christmassy. But see, that means I have to burn it this month. Because last time, that I, I'm telling y'all this is exactly what I did. I got all of these holiday smelling candles and then what happened was January rolls around, February, March, and I'm still smelling like Christmas. I was mad. I was like mad, mad. So. I'm thinking I'm going to like diversify my scents and I'm so glad that I got some good recommendations. But I really want that French baguette candle. That's what we call French baguette. That's what I really want. So I'm going to keep looking around. 
Oh, no, no, no. She said they don't have it now, but she did say I can get any other candle and bring any other candle back later when they get it in and just swap them out. So that's probably what I'm going to have to do. This smells exactly like Paris Cafe. It's called Freshly Brewed Coffee. I'm wondering if they will smell the same when they're burned. It says, enjoy the room filling aroma of fresh coffee beans. It smells really like fresh coffee. I love it. But it smells almost just like Paris Cafe. I want to get both of them, but it's almost like what's the point? Because I'm trying to budget, so I don't want to spend so much on um, candles, excuse me, that smells just like coffee, so I don't know. So I'm in line right now. I'm getting my stuff ringed up. I will. I don't know if I'm going to let y'all know what the total is because I got more candles than I said I was going to get, but we'll just unpack all of that. Probably Vlogmas Day 3. I might do like a whole candle haul thing and show you what I got, but I'm about to pay now. We might talk about the total. We might not. Okay, so I'm finally done. I am getting up out of here, so <sighs> we'll see. It is still kind of busy in here, but that's okay. I have what I'm going to get. I Listen, I hope y'all really um, were able to kind of enjoy um, shopping with me today because it was actually really, really full up in here, so it was hard for me to like vlog a lot, but at the same time, I had a good time. I'm glad I actually came. I really wasn't at first, but I'm actually glad that I actually stopped and came. Y'all, it done got dark outside and I still got on shades out here looking like a crazy person. <sighs> y'all wasn't gonna tell me that it's dark outside and I still got on shades. I put on shades because I don't know if y'all can see my eyes, but um, the other day I had on eye makeup and um, I think some of it, it was hot outside. Yes, in December, it's hot in Florida. It was hot outside, and so the makeup was like seeping into my eyes. And by the time I like went and looked in the mirror, my eyes were swollen and puffy. They might still kind of be red right now. And so my eyes were like running and puffy. It just looked so gross. I was like, oh my gosh, I cannot go out in public like that. So I've been wearing shades all day. I don't know if like right now it's cleared up a little bit or if they still look weird and red, but like all up here was like swollen. Y'all might be able to see it. But anyways, that's why I was wearing shades because I didn't want people to be like, oh, what happened to her eyes? Like, bruh, oh my gosh. Ah. Nobody would probably do that, but in my head, if someone even looks like, I'll be like, oh my gosh. I would hear them saying like, ah, even if they were just like. So that's why I was wearing shades, but hopefully it doesn't look as bad now and it's dark, so I can't wear them no more. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And if you want to get more deals, run deals, glitches, everything, just meet me at OCCGang.com. You're rocking with the OCC Gang.